this is an overview of everything that I will replace so delivery is nearly complete just a quick look of what going to be replaced <coughs> obviously all of the gaskets and the whole kit then I took the opportunity to buy as well a valve spring compressor to make it easier to put them in I have a whole set of new push rods new vol stem guides or oil deflectors these are the old ones, these are the new ones still have to figure out why these new ones are a bit different a new radiator hose then I bought some special super friction oil which I will put around the can, around the valves I bought new head fasteners, head bolts, these are the old ones <coughs> and if you look in detail, this one is a little bit bent on the engine there are two different types but from what I've read and measured it can all be replaced by <coughs> these new ones which I've bought which are much stronger as well, which are of a different type but the size seems to be correct. I bought from the same brand thread sealer, a lubricant, <coughs> and I bought a whole set of stainless bolts and nuts <coughs> that go on, for example, the manifolds, intake and exhaust, <coughs> timing cover thermostat housing kit, water pump, oil pan kit <coughs> and finally I bought a new thermostat housing because as you can see after years how oh, this is eaten in so I bought a new one and a new thermostat always watch out when you buy a new thermostat that it is of the same degree at the temperature at which the thermostat is supposed to be opening. So slowly I'm going to start putting everything together. The only thing I'm missing is uh, for the gaskets. I bought copper uh, film that you can spray on it. That should be the perfect sealant and that normally goes up to 650 degrees and that is the best that you can find on the market here. Yeah? That's the only thing I'm still waiting for. So, see you soon.